What's going on everyone? This is Alex USA Days. Uh, so today we're going to talk about salaries in California. Uh, I did make a video before on SB1162. This was a bill that was talking about posting uh, salaries if you post a job and you have more than 15 employees in California. So now this bill is law and uh, any company that's in California and has 15 plus employees or a company that's willing to hire for someone from California. So if you work remotely, they'll have to post the salaries or wages or they'll have to pay a uh, penalty. Uh, so now it's a lot easier to look up salaries. All of the companies are doing it now uh, and we can see the average salary in California. So we're going to do just that. We're going to take a look at some salaries in California in general. Uh, we're going to take a look at them at Glassdoor, some LinkedIn, and I found one government job that is a QA job, and I'll give you the pay range that they're showing. All right, let's get into it. So I will provide in the description a link to the bill for that law that, you know, says the jobs have to be posted and I'll post some links that I'm showing here right now in the description. So you want to check them out. You can go ahead and do that uh, for the searches here. So now if we're looking at software quality assurance engineer in California, uh, and this is just the general search for salaries, software quality assurance uh, in California. So your median now is at 1400. So it was a recent lays off. Uh, it seemed, this seems almost like a short drop in the payout, uh, but um, it's starting to pick up and doesn't look like economy, you know, crashed. Or people predicted some uh, you know, bad things happened in the U.S. economy. It looks like we're still strong on hiring uh, and we are at, well, your median is from 116,000, 116K to 180K. So that's your like the median spread, right? Your average salary would be 143,000 in California. Your lower scale would be starting at 96K and your higher would be at 200 plus K. Uh, this is not including years of experience uh, in all industries. As you know, as a Q engineer, you can work in any industry. Uh, you can work as a Q engineer in medical, you can work in airspace, you can work just uh, for some like startup or doing some gaming, whatever. Uh, okay, so the estimated total pay for software quality assurance engineer is $143,817 per year in California area with an average salary of $113 uh, per year. This numbers represent the median, which is midpoint of ranges from our uh, property total pay estimate model and based on salaries collected from our users. Uh, the estimated additional pay of is $30,400. 95 per year. Additional pay include cash bonus, commission tips, profit sharing. The most likely range represent values that exist within the 25th and 75th percentile of all pay data available for this role. So this is a very like large, um, very large grouping. So any position that all from 25 to 75 percent of the positions would would fit in that range, right? Okay. Um, so let's take a look at the, some companies that's showing here, uh, job openings. Uh, so Zenzar Technology, Software Quality Assurance, median 127K, starting with 108, 252K. Cisco System, uh, 412 opening for software uh, Q engineer, starting 156, up to 253, medium of 196, 925. Apple, Apple has a lot of job openings. Uh, software quality engineer from 154 to 247K. Um, let's get maybe to some like uh, less known companies or just startups in general. I don't, I don't see here. Um, any names that might have be be like a startup looking well alcatel listen uh okay not really startup code ploy okay software q engineer from 108k to 172k was medium 135k all right so this is data um from glassdoor right so glassdoor all over the california i think it represents a good amount of salaries 
Um, now let's take a look maybe like position by position in LinkedIn. Uh, this is the law I was talking about. This is the, I'm going to provide this link in the description, but this is bill number 1162 um, in regards of displaying the salary ranges. Okay, so here we go. I just did software quality assurance search in LinkedIn and California, United States, again, by state. Uh, the first one is promoted from Blizzard. So this is lead senior software development engineering test uh, from 101K to 186K, Blizzard. Uh, gaming industry in general known to pay a little bit less. So let's move uh, down to some position. So TikTok here, software development engineering test. So this is as that position. So this is more, more, more likely kind of not just testing, but automation uh, with some test scheduling and frameworks. 125K to 165K. Uh, senior software queue engineer, 106K, 117K. Uh, lead, let's find if we have not a senior position can we get regular not a senior position senior principal okay so let's take a look experience level um let's take associate entry take out senior and see what comes up one plus k results okay here we go so our environment Software quality assurance engineer, 95K, starting up to 162K. Um, a bot, software test engineer, to 65K, 230K. Software, uh, this one has no salary. System engineer, Q engineer, web UI, no salary. Software quality assurance engineer every then in Sunnyvale, 120k to 160k. All right, so this is LinkedIn. Uh, so LinkedIn is showing. So you can you can kind of see the median between Glassdoor and LinkedIn. Um, I think 120k is somewhere like mid level, and the senior level be could be up to 200k and 200k plus if you're doing like some automation as that or management. Uh, let's take a look. Oh, here's a senior. Uh, okay. So let's take a look at this position. This is from California career. So this is a government position a posting for software quality assurance analyst at the department of conservation, um, posted can be filled by seven seventeen. So there's like eight, nine days left for this position to be filled. Uh, here is from six thousand uh, dollars to approximately nine hundred nine thousand seven hundred dollars per month, right? So this is the salary range. Uh, the responsibilities are just regular uh, QA responsibilities. Uh, okay, so. Uh, desirable qualification, ability to communicate effectively, excellent computer skills, possess good and personal skills, ab ability to work independent as well as in team environment, ability to organize and prioritize multiple assignments, ability to promote positive work environment and relation with others. I mean, it would be great if there was like more uh, job description to this, but uh, looking at the ranges for this position, considering this is a government position, so probably you'll have a good like healthcare package and benefits with this. Uh, your range is starting, so the, the beginning of the range is about 72K a year, and the higher end of this uh, range is 116K a year. Now, again, because it's a government position, uh, you might look at a little bit lower end for your salary, uh, but you know, you should consider like the good government bonuses that normally come with that. So 100k plus uh, is still for the QA. Uh, is very achievable. Is very possible. And so don't get discouraged. Keep on looking. Keep on applying. I think uh, you know uh, some 
states might have a lower uh, pay rate for the queue engineers but because California now is posting and required to post job salaries and you can work remotely from any state for California or vice versa from California for any state in general the job salaries uh, they're going to go down and pick up because everyone's try. you will be competing for the resources so you know every, every company will try to match uh, the median on the market so the salaries might go up a little bit across the board okay so this was alex usa days hopefully this information uh is helpful thanks for, thanks for watching and bye bye